Hello and welcome to My Life for Iron's channel. This is My Life for Iron, and I'm casting a game I played. I don't know when.、Um, a while ago, a few days ago, before the recent patch. There's a recent patch because it tells me when I load this game, it tells me you have to disconnect from Blizzard. So、uh, I suppose this is from a previous patch, but not so long ago because I remember this match. So spawning on the top left is Glakafan, aka me. It's my Smurf account.、Uh, I created it long ago. This is actually a SEA account that merged into the NA account. And、bottom right is the Zerg player Arg Peter. I think it's Peter.、Uh, he's the Zerg player here, and he went for hatch first. It's a micro game, and so did I. Went for a, a standard build. I I almost never cheese unless I used to、uh, unless I try to Smurf hard、uh, into Gold League. Otherwise, I never cheese because when I cheese, I lose. Uh, okay, so the Zerg player is sending one drone to annoy the SCV、uh, worker, and does he can he get a kill? I don't think so. It's very close. The SCV is in red. It's, it has only 10 HP left, but so、uh, uh, the Terran boy pulled. Okay, why am I referring to myself in third person? I pulled two SCVs on the drone and successfully successfully chased him away. And now the barracks is done, and I send an SV to the low ground to get the expansion. And this this SV is still chasing after the drone. It's never gonna give up. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. And the scouting SV is coming back, so they they can. Oh. Oh, it didn't try to attack the drone.、Uh, it's okay.、Uh, the Zerg player transfers some drone to, down to the low ground、uh, to maximize the mineral income. It's very nice. Yeah, you see, this SCV is still attacking. Oh my god! And and that's the first blood of the game.、Uh, apparently, I forgot to uh, uh, tell the SCV to ret retrieve. Retreats and、uh, yeah, that's the unfortunate final fate of that SCV. He's getting killed by the drones. Okay, I'm microing this、uh, Reaper real hard and forgot to build a gas.、Uh, what a god! What a micro god! Okay, so both players are playing pr pr pretty sloppy.、Uh, I'm not sure what I was thinking because this is this is what is this? Where is this second gas? Oh my god! The second gas is like at least thirty seconds late, and the Zerg player is not trying to get a third. Is he trying to get a third? I don't see any draw. He's gonna scout a little bit, trying to catch the、uh, Reaper. But is his he is there still a few seconds until the、uh, link speed to be done? Hmm. He indeed sent the drone to build the third, and successfully successfully、uh, drove the Reaper away. So I think it's all fine. Now it's into a standard macro game, despite despite the early sloppiness from both sides. It's a weird play, you know. It's a really low level play. So what do you expect, right? So I think、uh, I was yeah indeed I put down a armory this early. I think I was going for some harass. Oh my reaper, rest in peace. So I was going for some not harass a a, a two base all in I would say. Yeah, I think I went for two base all in. So the Zerg was unexpecting anything fishy.、Uh, he got a mass queens. He got a bunch of、uh, evolution chamber and、uh, roach warren to block to wall off his natural. Fully prepared for the hellion run by, but I wasn't going for. The hell and run by. I was going for something more deadly, more fatal, more lethal, uh, uh, which is a cyclone hellbat push. It's a very, very good, effective build. But、uh, if you are prepared, it's uh, it's uh, you have a good chance to、uh, counter it. But I'm not sure the Zerg player is、uh, noticing what I'm doing. 
Uh, I'm not sure if he knew that it's gonna be a very big push in about one minute time. So he is supposed to uh, build a lot of uh, units. Just mass roaches is the only solution right here, or even ravagers. And some players can even get a lot of hydra set by this time, and that can also deflect this this kind of a uh, hellbat roach, a hellbat a hell hellbat cyclone push, but. This is not the case for the, the Zerg player arc, Peter. And indeed, I was getting a, a weapon upgrade as a weapon upgrade does do a lot of benefits uh, for the Cyclone. The, uh, the weapon, up, weapon upgrade is insane for Cyclone, uh, especially in early game if the Zerg or any opponent, if they don't have armor upgrade, it's going to melt them like melting cheese. Easy, okay. Uh, am I going for first push? Am I going for a kind of a scout, half scouting, half push thingy? It's already six minutes, so if if I don't push now, it's uh, it's gonna be never, now or never. Uh, first, I need to clear all the creeps here. This is a lot of creep tumors, and uh, because Zerg player had a, a lot of uh, active queens, and he's doing a good job of spreading the. Creeps, mm, not much spreading, but a lot of uh, planting the seeds. So I'm not sure about that. It's not the most effective way to spread a creep. Creep. All right. So the push is here. Uh, I was ready to uh, get down to business, and as you can see, the active force I was uh, definitely dominating. Because he had nothing but queens, and he he had he put all the energy into this uh, useless crypt tumor, and he couldn't even uh, transfuse each other. So there's no way he can engage and survive. So he had to retreat, wait for the energy to build up, and at this point I did not hesitate and push forward. And half the army, most of the army, are pushing towards the third, and some of them are pushing towards the uh, natural. Um, not sure if split, splitting up uh, is the best idea, but uh, I think it's gonna work out here because uh, due to the sheer amount of units here, he is uh, so totally unexpected. He had uh, 60 drones. Look at this. I killed already 24 drones. And indeed, he is a little bit uh, salty. My opponent said, play random, learn one build for each race. Uh, yeah. Yikes. That's what he thinks. He thinks I know only one build for each race. Well, that's kind of true for my Protoss. <laughs> I can only do two base all in. But for Terran, I have a lot of tricks for you. Next time I'll show you. All right, that's the game 